Jesse Sanders, owner and chief veterinarian of Aquatic Veterinary Services. Today we'll be discussing quarantining live plants before they go into your tank or pond. So I'm sure this might not have even crossed most of your minds, but depending on where you buy your aquatic plants from, if they have been with kept with fish previously, there's a potential that those plants could be carrying different diseases, mostly parasites and bacteria, into your tank or pond. So, what are you going to do to make sure that that doesn't get into your system? Well, if quarantining is completely novel, uh, we highly recommend that you watch our quarantine video so you can learn why it is so important that you quarantine every single new fish that you are bringing into your system, regardless of where it came from, what its history was, what the vendor told you. Um, it's really important to make sure that your fish stay safe and healthy. So the biggest thing with aquatic plants, now their quarantine period usually does not have to be as long. And why is this? So if they are saying carrying a parasite or bacteria that is specific to fish, it's going to require a fish host in order to grow and replicate. So easiest way to do that is to take your new plants and put them in a fishless system. So a system, no fish. And basically this will break the life cycle of any parasite or bacteria that is in there. And it also gives you kind of an opportunity to beef up your plants. So this is the time you can try out those aquatic fertilizers. There's no risk because there's, there's no fish in there, but you can really kind of beef them up and get them ready to go into your pond or tank. Um, thankfully, quarantine period for plants, once you break the fish life cycle, is going to be about two to three weeks. So about half what you would require for a fish, just fish quarantine. Um, certainly something to consider. Um, again, we want to limit the spread of bacteria and parasites and all sorts of other fun things. And quarantining plants, again, probably didn't consider it, um, but you'll, you'll know when it goes wrong. So quarantine plants, separate fishless system, two to three weeks, beef them up with some fertilizer, and you should be good to go. So thank you very much for joining us for our video today. We hope you learned a little bit about what fun quarantining is. Uh, if you have any more questions about fish, fish health, or even aquatic plant health, please visit our website at cafishvet.com. At Aquatic Veterinary Service, fish are treated like family.